It's, it's a loaded question. Uh, what's the complexity of your job? Are we just doing direct push? Are we doing uh, sampling? Are we mud rotary? Are we driving casing? Uh, I, my military guys that drill around the world, they take out first aid kits, the same things that they, we take out into active combat zones, things that they can do, t tourniquets, you know, uh, be able to stop bleeding, put uh, pressure on bleeding, uh, make sure that they have all the proper uh, equipment to fix a, not fix, but, you know, stabilize a person that had a severed arm or smashes their finger. You know, what we're trying to do on an active drill site is have everybody educated. So if a catastrophic event happens, when we call 911 in our first world country, we have enough time that they are going to be stabilized, picked up, and been able to get to a recovery area and have fast recovery. And then we have to think about the remote location and the severity of injuries that we can have. And if I'm working in the Atagama, Atagama Desert with uh, you know, BHP and Bort, these are the things I'm thinking about. If I'm in uh, Buckhorn Mine, Republic Washington, on a mountain, again, I need to think, do I have the proper tools that if my buddy, my colleague, my uh, geologist collapses or gets hung up in something, we can still call 911 radio, wait for the helicopter, and we can stabilize them. So it's, it's really got to be about the package of materials you need from emergency response of three to four minutes away to 30 minutes away.